I was speaking with someone and we were talking about a rap artist and that person sang, rapped a little bit of a song and it kind of made me think about in so many words I think much of rap music in a sense is like the gospel not saying that it is the same because with the Bible in the New Testament it is telling us how to be your frame of mind, how how it should be principles and stuff like that. And in rap music, or maybe some other bad music as well, I don't know if all rap music is bad, so in bad rap music or bad music in general, isn't it telling you how to be, how your frame of mind should be? Isn't it tell you how, isn't it telling you how your mentality should be? So in a sense, concerning what I am speaking of, isn't bad music kind of like the gospel? If you understand what I am trying to say to you. Maybe one of the reasons why you are having so much difficulty in changing your ways, maybe you are listening to the wrong stuff. Because if I want to raise higher in Jesus Christ, if I want to get better, what am I going to do? Probably read my Bible more. Read the Bible, right? Maybe listen to Christian music pray and stuff like that. So either reading or listening to principles of the Bible or being around people who is teaching or listening to teachings about the Bible. So when you listen to bad music, doesn't it have like the same impact? Aren't you learning how to be? How Aren't you learning how to act? Aren't you learning principles to apply to your life? Aren't you learning those things? So if you are trying to live for Jesus Christ, and you are listening to music about fornication, adultery, robbing, stealing, mobbing, and all this other stuff, wouldn't it make it difficult for you to live for Jesus Christ when you are... How can you do it? You may go to church on Sunday, and Tuesday, but at the same time, you are looking at what is that TV show called? R&B, hip hop. Uh, what is that show called? Hip hop stars are. I don't know what it is called. Like you are listening to Lil Wayne and Cardi B and all these people there, and you are looking at foul things on TV. But at the same time, you are trying to live for Jesus Christ. You are listening to two different messages, right? So if that be the case, 
Like, how can you be stable in trying to live for Jesus Christ? If one message is telling you to deny yourself and another message is telling you to not deny yourself, like, isn't there going to be conflict, some type of confusion, some type of whatever there? I'm telling you. So isn't listening to bad music in a sense, isn't it like maybe saying it, if saying it is like the gospel, maybe that is not the right thing to say, but isn't it like somewhat like a religion or some type of doctrine if you understand what I am trying to say. Because if I am a preacher or whatever else, and I am telling you about the Bible, well, I am trying to pull you closer to Jesus Christ. If someone is telling you about fornication, adultery, and hating people and stuff like that, trying to get you to do those things, isn't that person pulling you closer to Satan? Isn't that person pulling you closer to hell? So I would guess that person is a minister of Satan, right? If something is pulling you closer to hell, how can that be entertainment? No matter how well, no matter how good the beat of the song is, no matter how clever the lyrics are, if something is pulling you closer to hell, pulling you closer to Satan, getting you to disobey God's rules, shut it off, right? Shut it off. Bad music is not harmless. If listening to things about Jesus Christ will influence me to live for him, isn't the opposite the same? If listening to trash and demonic stuff is going to pull me closer to Satan and demons and stuff like that. Why listen to it? If you are Christian or if you claim to be Christian, shut all that stuff off. Shut all that bad music, bad movies, bad TV shows, bad YouTube videos. Shut it all off because I believe it is playing a huge role in your life. Well, Kevin, if I can't watch rated R movies, then my life is going to be so boring. I am going to be bored to death. Even if that is the case, so what, right? If you are eating poison, and you want to get better and you know you are eating poison but you telling me Kevin it tastes so good yes I am sick but it tastes so good but I want to get better so so I tell you hey stop eating the poison what Kevin no like why would I do that isn't there another way I can get better while eating poison? Man, please listen to what I am saying. Shut all that stuff off. Man, I am telling you, I believe the same way there are people trying to pull others to Jesus Christ. I believe there are people out there trying to pull you to Satan. I am telling you. I am telling you, please listen. Let me stop here. God bless you.